SDP. Thank you, Chairperson. Chairperson, the Land Court Bill was introduced on 20th of May 2021 and was referred to the Committee for Consideration and Report. And it proposes to establish a specialist land court with its judgment appealable to the full bench of the court to deal with all land related matters as regulated by legislation. And this one hopes will facilitate the speedy resolution of cases and contribute towards the development of appropriate jurisdiction on land matters. The bill also proposes a cheaper and speedy alternative dispute resolution mechanism in the form of mediation. And what is important is the court is established as a court of law and equity in respect of the Restitution Act and has the status of a high court that has the authority, inherent powers and standing in relation to matters under its jurisdiction. And it's clearly been a matter of concern that there have not been designated judges for a designated land court to deal with matters of this nature. And the ACDP clearly supports these provisions. Our only issue right from the outset related to the clumsy attempt to ask the Supreme Court of Appeals jurisdiction through the bill. And while we appreciate the speedy resolution of land cases is required, is required and that endless appeals should be avoided, such an ASTA could not take place through ordinary legislation. Section 1683A of the Constitution states that the SCA may decide appeals in any matter arising from the High Court of South Africa except in respect of labor or competition matters. Now it is important, the ouster of this SEA's jurisdiction could only take place through a constitutional amendment. And it is starting that the bill went through the whole process of cabinet approval of certification by state law advisors with a clause that asked the Supreme Court jurisdiction without a constitutional amendment. This was argued strenuously by the ACDP and thankfully, this clause was removed and in view of the fact that a constitutional amendment would be required and this would delay the bill. Sense prevailed and that offending clause was removed. And so appeals are permissible to a full bench and then to the Supreme Court of Appeal and to the Constitutional Court if necessary. In general, the ACDP then supports this bill as this one clause was removed and we trust that it will go a long way for the speedy resolution of very emotional land-related matters. I thank you. Thank you, Honourable Member.